Hi Vinash, welcome on your Pedia. Thank you, sir. And Avinash, let me congratulate you for your selection in a very prestigious job of uh, ATC ex Junior Executive, and uh, that is in Airport Authority of India. Congrats for that. Thank you very much, sir. Avinash, आज की interaction में मैं आपसे जानने की try करूँगा इस exam के बारे में और इस पूरी process के बारे में आप जानते हैं बहुत सा student है जो इस exam के लिए aspire करता है और ये बहुत अच्छी job है और वो जानना चाहते हैं कि कैसे selection होता है कैसे हम इसमें आगे जा सकते हैं so पहले मैं आपकी background जानना चाहूँगा आप कहाँ से हैं आपका schooling colleges आप कौन से college से graduation किया उसके बाद I'm sure आपने college से निकलने के बाद exams लिखे होंगे आपने gate वगैरह भी लिखा होगा बाकी exams लिखे होंगे कई exams में आपको failure मिला होगा वो सारा journey आप अपना share करें and then we'll come to airport authority sure sir sure my name is Avinash Kumar and I am from Jaunpur but uh, I was born and brought up in Varanasi, Uttar Pradesh, and I have done my schooling uh, uh, from CHS, BHU, Varanasi, and mm. uh, I have done my graduation in BTEC from MNIT Jaipur. Mm. And Good. Uh, <clears throat> then, sir, uh, I, I attempted GATE in 2022. Uh, mm. After graduating in 2021, I prepared mm. for sir uh, like uh, six months. I, I I think I prepared for GATE. Mm. Then. Uh, that sir uh, i didn't got uh, the good rank so mm. i left it there and then i started preparing for uh, ssc cgl mm. then mm. i attempted ssc cgl of july vacancy that came july in july then i qualified mm. ssc cgl prelims ssc cgl then came in march uh, mm. to three and mm. that time sir uh, one friend told uh, uh, tell, uh, told me that uh, you should attempt uh, ai atc also like mm. uh, I got to know that uh, this vacancy is also for us. Uh, like uh, mm. uh, we we can also attempt this. So mm. uh, uh, I got to know. Then I I thought I should attempt, but I was not preparing for it. Mm -hmm. I attempted anyway. Mm. Then uh, mm. after attempting, uh, I I got to know that uh, I I can do this also. Mm. I can do this. But uh, as mm. my interest was uh, not there, so. Uh, I left it there and then started again preparing for CGL because mm. uh, sir, I, I have not like technical. I, I think uh, I didn't have interest uh, at that time. Mm -hmm. Then after uh, that CGL mains, then uh, I started preparing next CGL because uh, in mains I got uh, a post, but I was not interested in that post. So I again started preparing for the next vacancy. Then it came again in July. Then I qualified for that. Then uh, uh, I I have wrote the means of CGL in October mm -hmm. 2023. Mm -hmm. Then vacancy okay. came, uh, ATC vacancy came in November. Mm -hmm. But this time I thought that I should join some coaching center or because I didn't prepare for it. Mm -hmm. So I thought I should give it a chance and uh, I should prepare for it mm -hmm. and give it a fair chance. Mm -hmm. So I researched about some coaching centers and online courses and then mm. I, I got found out that uh, uh, your education was my choice and mm. uh, I took that course in the mid of November after filling the form mm. and then uh, I started preparing for it because results were awaiting of the CGL mains. So mm. I thought uh, I, I, I should use this time for some mm. uh, like uh, mm. a prestigious exam and why mm. should I waste time? For waiting yes. the results so mm. i started preparing for it and took the uh, video video classes of uh, the europedia mm. and then uh, i managed uh, i didn't uh, take took the live classes i only okay. took the recorded version okay. of the live classes mm. Mm -hmm. and then i started preparing the notes and mm. then uh, i tried to cover the whole syllabus like mm -hmm. I didn't want to uh, leave uh, any of the topics as I am from mm -hmm. the electrical engineering branch. Mm -hmm. So uh, the twelfth part of the uh, syllabus uh, mm -hmm. was like uh, I have to like uh, I have to give only little bit uh, effort for that because mm -hmm. I am from electrical engineering background. So mm -hmm. uh, that twelfth section of physics mm -hmm. I have to give mm -hmm. a lesser time, and mm -hmm. then I concentrated on mathematics and eleventh part of physics. And mm -hmm. aptitude and reasoning was uh, like already prepared because SSC CGL had the uh, 
gave me the opportunity of preparing those uh, uh, those uh, part of that exam because i i got to know that uh, the syllabus of atc was like uh, aptitude reasoning english and gk and mm -hmm. all the four were covered from the ssc cgl preparation so i ha have to only prepare the physics and mathematics part and that's what uh, i took from the yourpedia the physics and mathematics course yes okay so avinash this was your journey uh, aap mnit ke hain aapne btech bhi kiya hai aapne mtech bhi kiya hai mnit ka and then you have written couple of exams also uh, no as far as this airport authority of india exam is concerned avinash to every year uh, what i am saying is uh, it is coming almost every year sometime twice a year also it comes so please tell students about this exam first what is this exam all about and uh, how much time is required to crack this exam the student who is listening to you right now he may not be having any knowledge base yes. and he may be fresh graduate and uh, i don't know what is your engineering background uh, I, I, I maybe i have not heard when you said and you electrical, 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 electrical right electrical. Okay. so what kind of background people can go for this exam i um, mean engineers or even science students or who can go for this exam and what is the pattern of this and how they can start somebody who is at zero level how we can think of going for this exam and since this exam is coming every year uh, we expect this exam will keep on coming so that gives one hope to students that okay if i prepare for this exam i may uh, crack this exam this particular year as you said that first time you wrote and uh, you realize that you can do it so agar wo pehle hi pata ho bachon ko nahi i am to do it and i can get it to ek saal shayad uska bach jaye jo aapne fir aapko experiment mein lag jata hai wo bach jayega to thoda sa is exam ke bare mein students ko please give the awareness yes sir sir first of all i didn't know uh, about it then i then after when i read it like it is a part of PS, psu and it is a mini ratna and mm -hmm. then I, i read the description of the job and uh, what are the uh, perks and what are the like benefits you 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 can achieve from this premium job and uh, it's it's like uh, the uh, syllabus of this exam is like uh, you have to have a understanding of the basic level of the class 12th standard like uh, mm -hmm. uh, uh, before 2020 i think uh, engineering mathematics was also there mm -hmm. but after that 2021 2022 and uh, the other recruitments after that the basic understanding of the 11th and 12th are required in physics also and in mathematics also so uh, it, it it is better to like give the time uh, like when we prepared for the je mains and je advanced so i think the uh, level is uh, uh, a bit like je mains or a bit lower like je mains so we can prepare like it also hmm okay so so uh, if some student is from electrical background mechanical background is there any difference because uh, is there any something uh, avinash that physics comes more from this part or less from this part so sir, how do students come yes hmm. sir sir last uh, time when i gave the exam sir i noticed that uh, uh, the 12th part was uh, more covered like uh, many many questions were asked from the 12th part of the uh, like physics physics 12th uh, standard physics were asked more question but uh, mm -hmm. this year was like uh, they asked like balanced they asked mm -hmm. uh, from 11th also 12th also and also in mathematics also the 3d vector matrices and uh, like uh, two three or more topics that they they covered more from the 12th standard part but this time uh, people faced uh, some difficulties because uh many many of us thought that uh, uh, 11th part is not so important so many of us like leave that 11th part and thought that uh, we can prepare the 12th part and we can crack the exam but i realized that uh, both the 11th and 12th part are important and we should cover the topics accordingly because the exam is uh, uh, as in the coming years exam is going to be unpredictable and uh, last to last year the do two years from the last two years the topics were coming from the 12th standard but this okay. year the standard 11th and 12th are both equally covered and the questions are asked from both the levels 11th and 12th mm -hmm. so avinash now think of uh, 2024 suppose airport authority exam comes in 2024 20, what will be your advice to students who are going to write this exam for physics first i mean ab humne bola ki pichle do bar to 12th mein se aaya 
इलेक्ट्रोस्टेटिक्स मैग्नेटिज्म एंड ऑल इस बार इलेवंथ वाला पार्ट आ गया मैकेनिक्स एंड ऑल तो इस बार जो दो में बच्चा जाएगा उसके लिए अविनाश का एडवाइस क्या है फॉर फिजिक्स सर अकॉर्डिंग टू मी स्टूडेंट शुड प्रिपेयर बोथ द पार्ट दे शुड फोकस लाइक द मेजर टॉपिक दो आर बिग टॉपिक दे शुड प्रिपेयर दैम फर्स्ट the easy topics or uh, the questions which are asked from the topics only one or two questions then they they can leave it from the last for the last but they should prepare all of it like starting from the major topics then uh, going the going uh, one by one to the lesser topics those those have little bit uh, advantage in that exam so we can mm-hmm. we can uh, take the idea from the previous year exams that which have more questions which have less questions but the exam is unpredictable now and we should prepare overall like 11th and 12th both hmm okay and what about mathematics avinash in mathematics sir i think this time uh, they have asked in some new questions also like uh, line- linear inequalities was not uh, asked earlier in uh, last to last recruitments and uh, two three more topics were there those were not asked uh, i'm not recalling sir uh, Two, three more questions were there. Like, not recalling those questions. But mm-hmm. sir, eleventh was eleventh part was covered a bit more than the last recruitment. Hmm. Okay. So other than physics and maths, what other uh, topics are there where students is to focus a lot? Uh, Avinash, take uh, English. We uh, have. Hmm. Yes, sir. I think, sir, uh, for my for my uh, for my preparation. i think it uh, ssc cgl helped me but uh, i i know that uh, there are many people those who don't want to attempt and directly attempt this exam so i would i would recommend that uh, the the questions those are asked from reasoning and aptitude those are also important and english and gk because total weightage of uh, the non technical part is 60 like 50% of the exam is asked from that, those, those portions and 50% 60 questions are asked from physics and mathematics so mm. as this is important that is also important so mm. for me it, it helped from the ssc cgl preparation but i would recommend that if a person is uh, taking the ssc cgl prelims version like they can prepare from the ssc cgl prelims uh, point of view like uh, they can to uh, take a course or take a book uh, for, for the prelims and they can like ssc cgl prelims version is equal aptitude and reasoning is equal to the atc aptitude and reasoning and english also sir because it is also covered in that exam hmm okay so abhinash uh, what about the new notification what is your take on that i mean uh, when will be the new notification for airport authority of india agar pichle kuch saalon ka dekha jaye track ki kab kab hua hai to kya is saal aane ke chances hain especially after election uh, results yes sir i think sir as this recruitment uh, is going on uh, m- many of the uh, uh, candidates when are like uh, when will go from for the training then after some time i think uh, as the uh, there is requirement of the atcs because as new airports have been also established and government is also trying to tackle the situation by recruiting more atcs so i think that uh, the recruitment will surely come Uh, maybe i think when our training will be in process and completion uh, i think sir november december i think october november december last 3 months i think vacancy should come hmm. now uh, suppose a student is interested to join atc why he should prepare only once notification comes why he should not start preparation in time kyunki jab notification aata hai to jab jahan tak main janta hu atc bahut fast recruitment karta hai Yes, notification yes, आता है फिर इमीडिएटली एग्जाम होता है फिर उसका रिक्रूटमेंट कर देता है बहुत ही कम टाइम मिलता है तो so, अगर किसी को एटीसी या एयरपोर्ट अथॉरिटी में जाना है जॉब में तो उसको कब तैयारी स्टार्ट कर देनी चाहिए जैसे आप बता रहे हैं कि इस साल के एंड में आने के चांस हैं लास्ट के तीन yes. मंथ्स में तो कब उस स्टूडेंट को प्रिपरेशन कर देना चाहिए एंड हाउ ही शुड गो फॉरवर्ड सर इफ फ्रेशर इज ट्राइंग टू क्रैक दिस जॉब आई थिंक लाइक विद ग्रेजुएशन इट कैन इट कैन बी क्रैक एंड बिकॉज if a if a person is from electrical or mechanical branch it will help him other branches mm. i am not sure but electrical and mechanical it will help but mm. if a person is, has prepared for the je mains or je advanced then also he has uh, prepared for the 12th and 11th then only he has uh, given the je mains and je exam and he has joined the engineering so mm. i think everyone from the engineering background can crack mm. this exam with the fresher because mm. sir uh, i the aptitude and reasoning version 
we all know that uh, these uh, aptitude and reasoning uh, versions can be prepared from the mocks also and uh, mm -hmm. as i told that cgl prelims version we can also take and uh, minimum time i think sir i took like uh, i think i took one month something i one month something for uh, preparing all of the course mm -hmm. and uh, for a person i think two three months is enough for preparing nahi dekhiye aap ek to mnit alabad ke hain aur aapka base acha tha electrical एमएनआईटी जयपुर के हैं आप और आपका बहुत अच्छा बेस था ऑलरेडी इसमें फिजिक्स में एम शो एंड आप इलेक्ट्रिकल इंजीनियर भी हैं वो पार्ट भी आपका अच्छा था आपने सीजीएल का प्रिपरेशन किया है वो भी आपकी एक प्रिपरेशन थी अविनाश लेकिन एक ऐसे स्टूडेंट का जिसका बेस जीरो है मतलब बहुत ऑर्डिनरी कॉलेज से बच्चा है उसको कितना टाइम लगेगा प्रिपरेशन के लिए ये आप बताए अविनाश क्योंकि एक मंथ मेरे को लगता है कम होता है बच्चे के लिए जिसका लेवल बहुत अच्छा नहीं है Yes, I think sir, seven, eight months will be sir. I think sir. मतलब छह महीने लेके अगर चले कोई कि मेरे को साफ़ छह महीने की तैयारी yes. करनी है yes. तो yes. कर सकता है वो राइट? Right? Yes sir. हम्म हम्म अच्छा अविनाश अब इस जॉब के बारे में थोड़ा सा बताओ। I'm sure आपका आपने काफी नॉलेज गैदर कर लिया होगा आपकी जॉइनिंग कब है और ये जॉब के बारे में थोड़ा सा किस तरह की जॉब होती है ये पोस्टिंग कहाँ मिलती है कैसा है सर जितना अभी तक मैंने सर लाइक जॉब के बारे में रिसर्च करी है लाइक like, इसमें सर अभी तो सर सिक्स मंथ्स की हमें ट्रेनिंग के लिए जाना पड़ेगा पहले अर्लियर सर मंथ्स की ट्रेनिंग के लिए भेजते थे बट अब शायद रिक्रूटमेंट फास्ट करने के लिए लोगों को ट्रेन करके जल्दी से लाइक uh, पोस्ट like, करने के लिए उन्होंने रिक्रूटमेंट लाइक अरे सॉरी ट्रेनिंग का उसका टाइम ड्यूरेशन कम किया है तो सर सिक्स मंथ्स की ट्रेनिंग के लिए जाना है एंड सर इसमें ये है कि लाइक वेन वी आर पोस्टेड वी विल बी ऑन द एयरपोर्ट ग्राउंड टावर एंड वी हैव टू लाइक कम्युनिकेट टू द पायलट एंड वी हैव टू टॉक टू द पायलट and uh, the radio communication will be there and the landing procedures and the the uh, opera operational procedures we have to deal with those procedures and uh, mm -hmm. the job is of like sir uh, shift job it is a shift job and there is a morning shift there is a afternoon shift and there is a night shift and uh, and uh, uh, the job is like sir i think 6 to 7 hours we have to give it and after mm -hmm. that we are free sir we can do like anything we want and uh, we can also do some like we can uh, fulfill our hobbies and all and can prepare for other exams also there is work work life balance is uh, to uh, totally there yes sir work life mm -hmm. balance is very very mm -hmm. nice sir kyunki meri jin na atc se baat hoti hai vinash jaise jo 5 saal 4 saal pehle atc mein gaye hain students jin se baat hoti hai to i find satisfaction in them they say सैलरी अच्छा है प्लेस ऑफ वर्क अच्छा है वर्क एनवायरनमेंट अच्छा है तो आ, मेरे को लगता है कि ठीक है वो अच्छा उसमें उनका सिस्टम बन गया है और ऐसा yes. भी मेरे को नहीं नजर आता कि साहब वो इधर उधर जाने की ट्राई करते हैं कि साहब हमें कहीं और चले जाना है इंडोल तो नॉर्मल अपना कर रहे होते हैं उससे अपना काम कर रहे हैं और अच्छा है तो जॉब सेटिस्फेक्शन मेरे को अच्छा लगता है सो आई थिंक ओवरऑल बोला जाए तो दिस इज अ गुड जॉब वट यू से yes sir and is sir p psu and you know it is a mini ratna so i think sir it is a like a good premium job hmm chaliye bahut acha hai avinash aur kuch aap batana chahein bahut aap bolna chahein students ko jo aapko sun rahe hain abhi avinash sir main to itna hi kehna chahunga sir ki like maine bhi sir failure sir ek do teen sir maine bhi exams sir kafi diye hain but majorly maine ssc ke liye prepare kiya but exams maine kafi di sir and this is my first job sir i have not gotten any job in last 3 years i have graduated in 2021 so uh, there were ups and downs and uh, i think if you don't lose hope uh, and try and then try then you can achieve some day surely mm chali bahut acha hai avinash so uh, avinash let me first thank you uh, you spared the time uh, to uh, you know tell so many things to students uh, for this exam atc exam and i must uh, wish you all the very best for your career ahead avinash is stage pe aapko bahut acha job mila hai and i am very sure you are doing going to do justice with your profession uh, with your job and uh, in return you are going to get the best out of this particular job so all the very best for your career ahead avinash thank you sir thank you very much sir